Alright, in this video I'm going to show you guys how to remove the formatting cover and the formatter on an HP LaserJet 4250. Um, the cover is this one right here. It, uh, it's the easiest cover of the printers to remove. Um, you just simply grab it right here and just pull it straight back. And then this is the formatter right here. You can see it's held in by two screws. So you can go ahead and remove those. And then to remove the formatter, once you have the screws off, you just grab it um, however best you can. A lot of times there will be a metal piece that's covering this, so you'll have to grab it kind of from the front like that. Um, just grab it and pull it straight back. It can kind of be tough to pull out, so just don't be scared to pull it kind of hard. Um, in the formatter, I'll show you this. You can see that there are slots for memory and for um, for SAP cards for different like barcodes and whatnot in case there's a special font or something that the, the machine needs to use um, and this is with the connector that connects it to the machine and you can see its partner piece is right here so when you were to reinstall it you can also see that there are two metal hooks here those fit in on the back side of the formatter so what you want to do when you're reinstalling this is just start with it kind of out about that far off the machine and get it flush up against the the chassis and then just slide it straight in you'll feel it kind of click in and you'll, a good way to tell that it's in place also is to make sure that the screw holes are all lining up and once it's in there then it's in there it shouldn't go anywhere um, then you can throw your screws back in there but for the moment I'll just take it back out and that is how you take out a formatter for a 4250